Welcome to the Old Timer Centre. My name is Philip Tarrant and I'm going to be talking about this 2007 Volvo XC90. It's got the 3.2 litre V6 engine and being an XC it's an all-wheel drive. The 3.2 litre V6 engine is very very smooth, reliable and surprisingly economical for for a car of this size. This executive has a timber steering wheel along with other wood grain inserts including around the gear shift. It's in beautiful condition. It's hard to see in this light but it's actually got a dark brown dash with beige on the doors and cream seats. It's absolutely beautiful. It's a seven seater it's got tinted windows, two remote keys, and it drives beautifully. The car's in excellent condition. It actually had seat covers on it when we got it, which is always good to see. It's got parking sensors. So this car's just come in. We've just literally given it a wash and a vacuum. And look how good it is. If you're in the market for an XC90, I'm hoping you've seen a couple already. I'm sure you'll find that they often have dents, scrapes, they've had a dog or a pet in the car and they're just generally very grubby. This is just simply not one of those cars. I can't see a single dent or scratch on this car whatsoever. Even when you look in the back, you can see here, you can pull that out. They're usually broken, you know, the 12 volt cap gets lost really is a very impressive car. It's got parking sensors as I mentioned, electric fold-in mirrors, rear air conditioning. If you look it up you can google it if you like. It's my understanding in the United Kingdom there has never been a fatality recorded in a Volvo XC90. That's very impressive. I doubt there's many, if any, car manufacturers that can boast the same. I guess that's, that's saying that this is a particularly safe car. Not only is it safe, it's also a very nice looking car. Great color combination. It's reliable. This model came out in around 2003, 2004, and being a 2007, it's basically been built several years after it was originally launched, which just means that there's any little niggly issues. I know the very early ones had some gearbox problems and things. But you'd like to think that they've been sorted by now. We're starting to see them with nearly 300,000 kilometres. So with 95,000 kilometres, we think this is a, a pretty low kilometre example from 2007. Uh, they are available in a D5, which looks good on paper. looks like you save lots of money on fuel. But you've got less power. They're noisy, grubby, and they're actually not as cheap to run in terms of maintenance. You've got turbos, glow plugs, injector problems. So in a lot of cases, you're probably better off with a 3.2 litre six, despite the, f the saving in fuel. But we think this is a very impressive car. I don't think it's going to last very long, especially in such a lovely colour combination. If you have any specific questions for us, you can contact us on 029569999. We can help you with finance and we're located just 15 to 20 minutes from Sydney Airport. Thanks for taking the time to watch this video and we certainly look forward to hearing from you soon.